think uh, pretty early actually. So mm. uh, when we uh, saw that the firing pattern of these cells forms a strictly hexagonal structure, so very, very regular, almost like uh, a coordinate system, then that was it was crazy. so different from what anyone had expected that mm. we knew this would be a kind of revolutionary. Uh, so we worked on really uh, being sure that uh, there was no mistake in the data with lots of control experiments and then we sent it to nature and went right in. So that kind of confirmed our uh, suspicion that it was uh, important. Yet it was of course difficult to imagine that only nine years later it would be a Nobel Prize. <laughs> that is perhaps beyond but still, we, we knew that it was very important from the beginning. Yeah, and the exciting part of, of these cells is, like Edward said, that uh, we tried to do all this control to find out is there a, spe a specific odor, uh, does the rat see something specific that makes this uh, grid pattern, and there's none. And, and that means that this pattern is generated by the brain itself. And then it's like going into the brain and detecting the mystery of the brain by studying these cells. And if we start to understand even more how they are generated, we understand so much about how the, the brain is working.